Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Assalamu alaikum. So in this video, we'll talk about the load transfer mechanism. How the load is basically transferred from a building to another structural element. So the understanding of critical importance of a complete load path is essential for everyone involved in the building design and construction. So before discussing the load transfer mechanism, let's discuss about the importance of geotechnical engineering. So this chart explains well the importance and significance of geotechnical engineering. You can see here, majority of the engineering fields are directly dependent upon the geotechnical engineering. It can be structural engineering or transportation engineering. All are related to geotechnical engineering. You can see construction engineering, environmental engineering, earthquake engineering, engineering, hydraulic engineering, mechanical engineering, geological engineering, all are basically dependent upon the geotechnical engineering. Now let's discuss the load transfer mechanism, how basically the external load is transferred. So this is also called the load path. Basically, multiple elements are used to transmit the transmit and resist external loads within a building. These elements define the mechanism of load transfer in a building known as load path. So load path extends from roof slab, then it is transferred to the beams and then from beams to the columns and then from columns to the foundations and then foundation basically transmits the load to the underlying soil. So this is how the load is basically transferred from a bit to the soil. So this is called the load path. So this can be well understood from this figure. You can see here in a very hilarious way, beams are looking towards the columns. It means the beams will transmit the loads to the columns. Basically, the lo external load is firstly transferred to the roof, then from roof to the beams, and then from beams to the columns, and then columns are looking towards the foundations. It means columns transmit the loads to the foundations, and finally, foundations transmit the load to the soil. So this is how basically the load is transferred from building to the soil. I hope uh, you like the video. If you like the video, don't forget to subscribe and share. Thank you and uh, Allah Hafiz.